She's back with a veg ants. Page six hears that disgraced vegan chef and restaurateur Sarma Melngeles is making a sensational comeback attempt. Sources tell us that Melngeles, who pled guilty to fraud charges in 2017 after she bled her restaurant dry of cash, she claims, while she was under the coercive control of her ex-husband, is trying to reopen the very same Union Square hotspot that she defrauded. An insider told us that Melngeles, whose downfall was documented in the Netflix hit Bad Vegan, is courting investors for pure food and wine, which was once one of New York Magazine's top 100 restaurants but closed in 2016. Meanwhile, a page six spy spotted Melngeles taking what seemed to be a business meeting at a cafe on Irving Place last week before walking across the street to the former pure space, which we're told has been empty since her restaurant shuttered, unlocking the doors and showing them inside. She appeared on the Misunderstood with Rachel Uchidal podcast last month. And when Uchidal asked if she'd open a new eatery, she said, yes, in the right circumstances. She added that her goal is to make enough money to repay anyone who was left out of pocket by her misadventures. There's a bunch of different things that I'm working on that could repair the damage, which I take on as my responsibility, she said while declining to get into specifics about the putative projects. She suggested that she needed to find a major cash cow if she hopes to make good on her mistakes. People have said, why don't you open a food truck? Or why don't you do catering? And I'm like, that's not going to make $6 million. Melngeles didn't respond to our request for comment. 